Hello and welcome to Batflip Crazy YouTube. I am your host, Toby. Today we're going to take a look at spray charts. Uh, you may have seen some people posting images of spray charts from certain players who have been traded or have signed uh, as free agents or are rumored to sign as free agents uh, comparing their batted ball spray chart uh, compare, uh, in a different stadium. So I'm going to show you how to do that. I've had a couple questions about that. So first of all, we're going to go to the uh, Baseball Savant main page right here. You're going to click on StatCast Search right here. Now, assuming you're going to do a batter, you can also do this with pitchers, but mostly you see it with batters. We're going to go right here, change that to batter. Now, you can play around with the dates, uh, but really I'm interested in uh, a season. So let's take a look at the 2018 season, and let's do somebody who was traded recently. So let's. I'm going to do, I'm a big Jake Bowers fan, so we're going to do Jake Bowers right here. And that's really all you have to do is change that to batter, Select the season that you want and then type in the batter right here and then leave it as sorted by pitches And we're going to search for this and What it's going to give us at the bottom is Jake Bowers and all of the pitches that he saw he saw 1600 uh, and two uh, Pitches so and then so the percent of pitches right here 100% and we're going to go over to this graphs so Now this gives you a variety of different options uh, For what to look at but a lot of them are really cool like launch chart angles But we're just going to go over here click on spray chart and there you go. It populates Jake Bauer's spray chart right here. Now, what we're interested in, the venue right now is listed as Kansas City Royals. So what we want to do is take a look at Tampa Bay, where he was before. Okay, you can see right here. So he's got a couple hits right here, maybe should have been home runs. You know, and, and this is not an exact science, so you can't really say, oh, it should have been a home run because you just never know what the situation uh, was and how accurate the dots are, but it is a fun thing to look at. So we have there for Tampa Bay, and then we're going to take a look at how he does in Cleveland. Right here. So you can see, you know, again, some balls that maybe would be home runs. You could see where, you know, as a, as a lefty who can pull the ball in the air um, or, you know, that that, 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 that that might be a nice little place for him hit some home runs moving forward. So it's a fun exercise. It's not super accurate or necessarily, um, you know, based in any type of evidence, but it is fun to do. Now, in order to create the images that you often see, you just go down here and you click save as image and you get a PNG that pops up right here. And look at that. And the beauty of that is you can even edit it. You can even draw on it. You could say, uh oh, I ran out of space. Thank you. Thank you for watching the Batflip Crazy YouTube channel where we went over how you can. Uh, create a spray chart image or look at a spray chart uh, for a player to overlay their batted ball, uh, all of their batted balls in different stadiums. Hope you've enjoyed this. We have other uh, educational videos at the YouTube channel. Just go to YouTube and search for Batflip Crazy. Thanks so much.